What is up, everyone? Welcome back. Uh, today, um, we're going to be looking for Kobe Bryant rookie cards. A uh, couple of inserts. Uh, so we do a lot of Jordan chasing on this channel, but uh, obviously buying some Jordan boxes to get his rookie cards is a little pricey. So uh, Kobe's uh, my second favorite player. is an icon for a lot of people. And currently, his boxes are getting up there in price, but they're still get a bull. So we got this uh, 1996 Collector's Choice uh, basketball. So not the most... Um, not the best looking set in the world, but uh, still has Kobe rookie possible uh, possibilities. Some inserts, and uh, the good thing about these is the, these don't stick together too badly, uh, as far as I uh, remember, because the type of coating on it was like UV. So yeah, bought this recently. So it looks like they were trying to get twenty bucks per pack. Twenty? I mean, that's where the decimal is. But um, we didn't pay that much, so. But yeah, so we're going to do more Kobe uh, Bryant uh, chasing on this channel as well. I remember this set. Uh, definitely had a lot of these. Like I said, they're not the most like beautiful set, but we can get Kobe rookies. And that's what this is about right now. We'll take some MJs, of course, just like that right there. It says assignments, MJ. <laughs> so uh, I guess we'll count that as Jordan. We'll set that there. Um, I was always wondering about those little offshoots. And then uh, here's Carl Malone, Crash insert so that's a nice card we'll set that up there as well and let's see this is a whole craig elio so there's a so these were inserts as well this is antonio mcdice these are sticker cards um not sure what the values are on these but i think if they're a good player there still is value it's just because they're hard to keep uh keep nice we can also get some gold ones of these so these are uh, like three players i actually have a kobe gold like this uh from when i was a kid but um see if we can get some more so that's our first pack like i said not uh the, the upper deck at this point was doing a lot of different sets so we have some of those coming in and i think that this was probably one of the lower um tiered upper deck sets so you know you could actually afford it at the time and uh, uh so they didn't do too much with the cards but it's okay we know there's uh, another patrick ewing we know what happens um we know what's happened at this point so we know who to who to chase down and uh of course um you know bolstered my my jordan collection and i continue to do so but definitely uh want to continue to do that with kobe i have a pretty decent kobe collection i was lucky i was actually young and collecting at this time uh 1996 so uh for me it was just getting some basketball cards and so i got a pretty decent amount of kobe Bryant rookie cards um some cool insert ones and things like that so that that was nice. I see some of the, like if you some of the like Fleer Ultras and things like that. If you want to get uh, Fleer Ultra Kobe rookie, which I have now, I mean the box is like three hundred to like two thousand bucks. So uh, pretty interesting because the card doesn't sell for that much. PSA ten it can sell for you know a lot, but not that much. So I guess you're kind of banking on getting multiples. So there's another Simon Jordan card. I guess that's a type of insert. I'm not sure if they actually count as Jordans. They're always like. Whoever got Jordan, I guess, is the assignment. Jordan is the assignment. So, Jerry Stackhouse, Charles Barkley, Sir Charles, say Ryder, Steve Nash. Still collect a lot of Steve Nash. Uh, you know, big uh, superstar, and keep these nice and clean. Um, so we'll take some Steve Nash out of there. That'll be that'll be good. There's Mr. Glenn Robinson. Uh, this was also so this was like the base. So you would find the sticker cards. Uh, that we we had which is right here and then you this is the base card and you would take the sticker and put it on there and try to put this on there so <laughs> pretty dirty work but uh card companies are hiring you to do their job there's eric snow and um no one we're looking for there so got 36 packs so we have a lot of opportunity um i have a friend who uh also bought one of these boxes online that it was a pretty good deal uh for 1996 1997 um so and uh he didn't pull any kobe rookies so um <laughs> we're gonna have to see how we do but we did get a ray allen rookie right there so i like that there's ray allen's rookie card sleeve that up in a second still getting uh still gonna collect his rookie card if uh, we can find it so let's go ahead and we'll move these sticker cards over mr sharif abdul rahim mark jackson Craig Elio, there's Reggie Miller, playbook card, followed up by Anthony Hardaway. We should get a lot of Anthony Hardaway in this set. It was uh, featured 
uh, which is fine by me. I, I like Anthony Hardaway. I, I still have a big uh, a book of his stuff. So looks like you could have the cuts be a little off still too. So that'll play a factor in uh, whether we get cards worth PSA 10 or not. So let's grab some of our penny sleeves real quick. And I'll, I'll penny sleeve those Jordans uh, in a minute. But for sure, the, the big rookies all penny sleeve right away, especially these ones that have the uh, serrated uh, separating uh, splits in the card because... You know, we don't want that to anything to happen to that. So set you up there and we'll keep going. But I got a lot of mid-90s basketball, uh, late uh, late to mid-90s basketball coming in. I'm going to start chasing down a lot of like uh, Kobe rookie cards and kind of the same thing I was doing for Michael Jordan, only for Kobe. So that'll be nice. And, you know, some of them are short printed. So, I mean, they're still not super, uh, they're not extremely cheap, but... They're they're definitely gettable as far as uh, you know if you're trying to find some of uh, some of those in a couple of years from now they're probably going to be pretty pretty expensive so there's Gary Payton right there still collect a lot of him so here's a uh, Deathless Tramp and Tony Kukoc, Tony Kukoc so we can get uh, Michael Jordan in this uh, format and we can get Kobe in that format so there's Tim Hardaway right there poster boy for collector's choice. see Allen Iverson all right nice so we got one of our our big rookies out of this uh set it's Allen Iverson of course we want Kobe but we'll take uh we'll still take plenty of Iversons still very collectible and uh brings value so that's nice another Gary Payton it's a team card the Raptors these are stuck together is this an error card or am I wrong? Is it a checklist of some sort? I thought this was like the back. Oh, this is the checklist for this. Okay, I was like, I thought it was just two backs. That was going to be huge, actually. Uh, error cards, you know, people like to collect the error cards. So if you ever, uh, they're hard to spot sometimes, but um, yeah, if you uh, get a couple, you can, uh, you know, they're rare. So that's what people like the rarity. All right, Robert Pack and uh, Elliot Perry. So I'm not looking for that person. And then here's uh, Lloyd Vaught, Otis Thorpe, another Tim Hardaway. And who do we got here? This is a nice one. It says De uh, Dikembe, Patrick Ewing, and Alonzo Mourning. So that's a nice one. I like to, some of these serrated cards with great players, <clears throat> I'll uh, I'll keep on the side. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, because, as you know, like uh, the big namers are always going to bring the most money. But um, <clears throat> over time, those will... Those will uh, appreciate in value. So, especially when they're all Hall of Famers, that's uh, that's what you want. So, there's another assignment card. I'm not sure what these count as. They're even desirable. There's another penny, but it's like the the playbook penny, so not even the base penny. It's another sticker card. Hmm. Is there a sticker card of Kobe? I can't remember. Probably not. Yeah, you can see those base cards are pretty brutal. So I guess if you had the collection of the two, then, you know, it might be worth something. But and there's uh, Tony Dumars, probably the best, uh, the best person on that card. But still got plenty of packs. We'll keep going. Not going to rush through it. Um, you know, anytime you're chasing down like Kobe Bryant rookie card or any sort of special insert or expensive MJ, you wanna, you know, wanna make sure you're going through it the, the right way, so. Uh, there's Akeem and Shaq, I like that card a lot, so keep that aside. Uh, like I said, they're not the most, just like, they just look super basic, but the players in the era at the time were amazing, so we get some great players out of this. And there's Marcus Camby, I used to collect a lot of him. Chris Gatling, and there's a bonus. All right, Ray Allen. Nice. Got a Ray Allen rookie right there. So that's great. Um, I guess I have to guess who that is. There's Byron Russell. And uh, there's Akeem Olajuwon. So that's a good card. I'll, just, I'll still set that aside, actually. I'll just set all those aside with any good players on them. Um, just, just because, you know, you never know. So if they're not, like, huge players, I have a couple over there. I won't, uh, I won't put them in, but... 
for uh, Hakeem. I think he's earned the right to uh, get penny sleeved and later. So <clears throat> there we go. We got Ray Allen. We got Allen Iverson. And we got a, another Ray Allen up here. So now all we need is a, uh, a Kobe Bryant or two or five. And uh, I'll be feeling real good. A couple of MJs. It'll be good. So Sharif was big at this time as well. as one of the big prospects. So I had like way too much of him. <laughs> I, have, I have so much Sharif Abdul Rahim. It's like... I don't know what to do with it. It's like, it would take me like a day to unsleeve all his cards that I have. So, I guess he's just going to keep living in limbo. Um, there's LJ right there. I guess we got the sticker card in one every pack, maybe? I'm not sure. So, Ken Norman pulled a beam team of his, unfortunately, in another uh, another break you can watch on this channel. It was a good break. We got <laughs> We beat the odds. It was just... All the players are uh, were odd. So there's Clyde Drexler, probably the best sticker card we've come across so far. So I don't know who these are when there's no one on them. And I know we probably got this one. So I'll keep the good stickers on the side. And then I'll, I'll rifle back through um, and I'll uh, find the uh, adjoining uh, base. And then we'll just put them together. We're not going to stick them together. We'll just keep the, the two, uh, two together. So, all right. Just going to add Kobe to that trio. Feeling real, real good. Let's see. Smiley Walker, Anthony Peeler. There's two cards on Anthony Peeler. Clifford Robinson. It's Patrick Ewing. Don McLean. Patrick Ewing again. <laughs> I always look at those little three ones too early. I should flip it over and pull that out first because if I'm putting too much pressure on this uh, on these cards and there's a kobe and i kind of break it off it's not good so um better guarantee that it's in great shape if it's still on with the other players so we'll, we'll uh <clears throat> i'll start trying to do that i sometimes i lose my place but uh we might be able to get there but yeah i got a lot of basketball coming in so i'm excited for uh this month so that'll be nice and oops, sorry mr allen iverson so there's Otis Thorpe, John Stockton. So John Stockton, you get the Akeem Olajuwon treatment. So you get to go up there. And there's John Stockton again, base card. So who's this one? Brian Grant, gold. I'm not sure if that's uh, special. The other ones are like silver. So I guess I'll keep that aside just in case. There's Tom Gugliotta. He's a great uh, player for a while in the NBA. He collected a lot of uh, Googs. And uh, Vlad Divac. Is Ray Allen again on the front or no? Is Ray Allen again? I don't know. I, I could never bring my head around if I... When I was a kid, I'd be like, oh, that's kind of a Ray Allen card. But it's really not. But I guess old habits die hard. So, all right. No Kobe yet. Getting, uh, getting closer to the end of the first uh, half of this box. So we need a ba basketball gods to... Bless us with a Kobe Bryant rookie card. Take the edge off earlier. And then all the rest are are just going to be for fun. There's a sticker card, Joe Dumars. There's Fish. Horace Grant. Nick Van Exel. And we got Juwan Howard. You're kind of in that realm for me, Mr. Juwan Howard. But I think you'll be okay if I... Set you aside and keep going. So, all right, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six packs left for the first half of the box. So we're still we still got plenty of shots, but don't like not getting one uh, early because then the uh, suspense slash uh, stress grows. Of course, we're getting plenty of Shreve Abdul Rahim. Can't get enough, huh? There's another action show, or a sticker card. Sam Cassell. There's that checklist again, so not special at all. Twice as ugly. Corey Alexander, and here's another Simons card for uh, Joe Dumars. So, not sure what these are. If they're if they're a little set, I mean, it looks like there's a ton of them because that checklist was humongous. So, <laughs> not sure if I'll ever even want to try to finish that, but. I do feel pretty good. We got a couple of big rooks right there. So I just would like to add some uh, purple and gold to uh, to our little collection there and feeling real good. 
I'll even take one of these just to just to take the edge off while we're searching. Damien Stoudemire, I have a lot of him. This horse Grant. Gary Payton, I guess that's a, another good one for the sticker book. Anthony Peeler, here's that Shaq card again. So that's cool. Take that. And Jerry Stackhouse was a personal favorite. Well, I've got a lot of these in this one. There's Shaq and Penny. So this does actually count as a Shaq, uh, uh, a Jordan, sorry, a Jordan and a Penny. So it doesn't count. So that's a legit like Jordan card. So I'll sleeve that up in a second. Once we get through these last few packs, I'll uh, oop, do a little, uh, get my, my drink there. Uh, do a little uh, Jordan sleeving. So let's see. Gary Payton right there. Sure. Why not? And then there's uh, Anthony Goldwater. There's uh, George McLeod. Mark Price. Sharif Abdul Rahim. Get out of my life. No offense. I actually, I liked him, but. All right. So here's a Kobe Bryant card. Uh, ooh, hello. Um, like I said, these actually count as like, you know, you'll see the split cards. Uh, Kobe Bryant's name on it. So it's got, um, it's part of a little series. Not as desirable, but still, uh, I'll take it to take the edge off uh, as far as us pulling. Uh, sorry about that. Pulling a Kobe rookie. So we'll sleeve up that. We'll sleeve up uh, our Jordan real quick. Sort of Jordan, half Jordans. But uh, that's good. That's at least something right now. It's going to make me feel a little better. See Kobe hanging out up top here with the fellas. And we want a full Kobe, of course. Uh, we'd like to get two. But, um, well, yeah, I'd like to get two or three. <laughs> that's just how that goes. So. All right, so we got one Kobe, half Kobe, which is good. It's something. Um, my friend who ripped uh, this, basically the same. I I'm in series two. He had a series one, but he didn't get any. Uh, so I think uh, he would kill for that right now. Um, so I'm, I'm feeling a little better. Let's see. Gary Kittles. It's another Carl. Alonzo so Morning. And that fake Ray Allen card that we have five of that I should stop putting over there. So, all right, down to two packs for the first half of the box. So, let's keep going. I guess it's going to be about a 30 minute video, but, you know, it's fun. Kobe Bryant rookie uh, card searching is always uh, suspenseful. So, see what we can get out of here. All right, so there's uh, Stefan Marbury. I used, I used to collect a bunch of him. And uh, he's actually big in uh, China still. They love their basketball, big basketball players out there. And he's like one of their uh, their favorites. So you can actually uh, sell his cards pretty easily. And there's Penny Hardaway. I'm guessing this is probably one of the better stickers that you can get as well. Uh, Mr. Dominique Wilkins, Rod Strickland. Let's get, uh, who's that? Sean Kemp? Yeah, Sean Kemp there. Burrows, um, football joke. All right, last pack of the first half of the box. So if you're still here with me, we uh, grow on the channel. We appreciate the like and subscribe. Um, you know, want to be able to uh, bring you more. We're gonna bring you more. I'm already hard committed to uh, some boxes. So at least uh, once I get to there, if we have uh, enough support, we'll keep going. But I think we're we'll be solid. But we appreciate that. Wanna definitely wanna um, be able to interface on YouTube better. So it's like. Uh, these get past these barriers that they've uh, put up and uh, i get it you know you don't want to get they don't want like anybody starting up first day to just start uh putting too much data on their website so totally get that it's anthony mason all right that's half the box so um we kind of have a kobe <laughs> you know it's like um if we end up with no Kobe's, then I guess I'll still take it. I mean, there is Kobe. It is a rookie. It is a one-on-one -on -one card. So his name's on there. It gets sold as a Kobe card. So it is a Kobe card. It's just, you know, you want one full one uh, to themselves. So there's uh, Eddie Jones. He's a family fave with Caffey stuck to the back of him. 
Lakers. It's Drew there. Steve Nash. We're still collecting Steve Nash. There's another assignments card. Followed up by another one. So two assignment card back to back. That's Reggie Miller. I mean, is it is it Jordan's card or is it Reggie Miller's card? It, I think it's Re they're Reggie Miller's card. Like it's, that's the uh, other player's card. There's Sean Kemp. And Jason Kidd. So let's go ahead. We got plenty of packs left. Half the box. Let's get that Kobe Bryant rookie card. The full one. Although really glad that he made an appearance at all. It didn't have to do that. Thank you, Kobe. Um, and there's Patrick Ewing, Mutombo, and Alonzo again. I like that three for it's a nice little trio there. Nick Van Exel. And there's a... Uh, Addison, Raphael, Antoine Walker was also a uh, a rookie in this year. He could have been uh, a lot more. I collected way too much of him, so he could have been up here if had uh, things broken the right way for him. Uh, and you know, work ethic and all that, all that, all that little stuff that you know may or may not matter. Lots of these in. So, all right, another one down, and another pack in. So, just uh, uploaded a, uh, uh, we're doing a lot of insert chases, so I, like I said, I'm doing a lot of Jordan insert chases. I did some Jason Kidd and Grant Hill insert chases. Um, so, we're switching that over to Kobe. And uh, so, I got a lot of, like, random, like, late 90s, early 2000s, early 2000s boxes that uh, have some cool inserts in them. So, I'm excited about that. There's Jason Kidd. Um, and so I'm happy about that. Happy to be there's Patrick Ewing. And, uh, so we'll see what we can get out of there. I, um, the, and some of them have uh, auto, uh, opportunities for, uh, sorry, I keep hitting this thing, uh, uh, for Kobe. So very low, uh, probability of that. And, um, but you know, the fact that you can pull some co cool Kobe inserts, uh, if it's past 2003, you can get LeBron. If it's pre- uh, 2000, you could basically get Jordan. So like, those are good boxes for me because there's two, I mean, along with Shaq and all these other great players, there's two major stars that you can pull. I'm going to stop collecting and putting those there. I'll get them after, um, along with a bunch of inserts and possible autos and things like that. So, um, that's cool. So it's a pretty fun time. Pretty cool to walk down memory lane. This is a thick card. Um... Nope. So Kobe comes in this form too. He's on this side, but no Kobe there. So this one's going to be a kind of a slower burn, I guess, a little longer video, but um, I'm going to pay with it. I, certain boxes that, you know, are less uh, cheap. <laughs> I like to take my time as well. Sometimes I, I know the, the chase cards and I just kind of burn through everybody, but these are nostalgic for me. So I like looking at them again. Along with, uh, you know, the longer I don't get to the end, <laughs> the more, if I don't pull a Kobe, the more I draw it out. So right now I'm feeling great. Got plenty of packs, but, uh, you know, if I rush through this and we end up with uh, no Kobe's other than that one, then uh, I'm not going to be feeling as good. So I want to, I want to save my feelings for a little bit here. All right. Box was in rough shape. You can tell this like from a card shop. They threw in like 36 packs. So... Not sure. I mean, they're foil packs, so they're pretty much impossible to Scotty Pippen to search. But um, like I said, where there's a will, there's a way, right? And uh, I mean, I don't think so, but could could hurt our odds, help our odds, depending on. Uh, well, I guess hurt since we haven't gotten uh, really one yet. But since uh, it looks like there was kind of just a made box, like they had a box open and they had X amount of packs lying around. They're like, let's make a 36 pack box. Uh, which is fine. I mean, I'm still getting 36 packs and uh, they're unsearched. So, you know, there's that. There's Jordan assignment again, followed up by another one. So, you know, a lot of those. There's a ton of these. Kind of takes away from uh, getting those. I mean, it's a card, it has Jordan, it says Jordan. I'm not sure. I guess you could sell them as a Jordan card. Unsure. Or just fill out a collection if you want more Jordan on a page. So, 
we got here? Kevin Wills. And we got Clarence Witherspoon. So no one looking for there. So we're 1996. So we could use a Shaq. Could use a Jordan. There's Latell Sprewell. Go ahead, show up, guys. No big deal. Make an appearance. Charles Smith. Brian Russell. Irving Johnson. So, almost uh, three packs left on our... Three packs left on our uh, third stack. So, after that, those two, we have one more stack. And then, uh, we'll see where we're at. So, feeling pretty good, actually. I mean, a Jordan and then a, a base Kobe would uh, make me feel great. But... Um, but we did get a Kobe, we got Ray Allen, we got Iverson. So that's kind of cool. This feels like a sticker card. Oh yeah, I felt like a weird insert there. So let's see, who else we got going on? Is this another one of those? <laughs> Number two, okay, well, together they make one Kobe, I guess. Uh, so I'll take a couple of those, like starting to turn the, turn the tide here a little bit. Uh, Kerry Kittles collected a lot of him. I like the so even though these are like a little lackluster, uh, the comfortability of chasing a Kobe rookie that you know isn't going to stick to the other card and rip off is really, really nice. Because I've opened some 1996, 1997 boxes where they're bricked like crazy. And uh, I've pulled Kobe's where even with the, the gentlest of hands and a lot of time, you end up, uh, you end up, tearing those cards up and so uh happy to have that so we got two kobe's um you know take them as you will like they're less desirable than probably the kobe like that but they're still kobe rookie cards so hey give them to me um so one regular one though would be sweet chris gatling clyde the glide drexler there's a uh, not Kobe, Eldon Campbell. So I'll even take one like that. <laughs> so if we get one like that, we have three half uh, Kobe's. But, you know, beggars can't be choosers. You don't know what you're going to get. So there's another one of our sticker card bases. John Wallace. Lonzo Morning. All right, last pack. And then we're into our final our final stack of 1996 Collector's Choice Basketball. Um, there's another Ray Allen, so that's a great card. It's good for us, so take another one of those. Um, who's on the back here? Uh, but still would like a base Jordan out of this as well. Or a uh, base Kobe Rook. Always look at I me. Mean, that's the whole point. We're, we're only here. There's nice Dave Robinson for Kobe rookie cards, really. Um, everyone else in the set, you know, they're great players and all, but I don't know if I would have bought the box um, had Kobe's rookie not been in here. <laughs> I, I would definitely not have bought in the box. So, uh, all right. So we got another Ray Allen there. That's good. That's another one of our big rookies. So we got one whole stack left. So a quarter of the box to find our Kobe. Uh, rookie cards so probably about a 35 minute video um which you know for certain breaks i'm okay with other ones where it's like the cards are less desirable and the you know i make them a little shorter but uh with this break i don't mind or the, any of these like intense uh basketball breaks i mean intense it's not the most expensive set in the world but you, know, you could definitely have gotten two boxes for this box there's no question about that um, well, I guess that's, you can do that with anything if you're savvy enough and you have, uh, the right price. So there's, uh, we haven't gotten, uh, Rasheed Wallace yet. So that's a sign of hope. Maybe the other cards in here will be different. There's a fake Grant Hill card. It's like that. Here's another one of our Jordan assignments. A lot of those Jordan assignments. I don't know what to do with them. So they're like half inserts. So it's like, you know, you like the, of course they're Michael Jordan. So you're like, oh, thanks. Sweet. But then they still look great. They don't look too great. All right, Penny. Tap you. Want you to wake up Kobe in there. 
tell them, hey, come on out. People want to see you. There's Clyde Drexler again, followed up by Larry Johnson. That's a nice little back-to-backer right there. Checklist. Filler. Mutombo. Walter McCartney. McCarty. Always do that. And Sean Elliott, Terrell Brand, and Gary Payton again. I don't know what to do with all these little Gary Payton cards. All right, no Kobe in there. So got some pulls, got a couple Kobe's, but I want one full one. That's the, the goal. I, I Honestly, you always feel like you're going to be the one. I was like, I can get two. I can get two out of here. Now I'm like, okay, give me one. I'm sorry for my hubris. Um, Sam Perkins, Danny Manning, Glenn Rice. So not too worried about you all. There is Sean Kemp. Bob Hurley. Eddie Jones, like I said, another, it's a family collection thing. Um, MJ, insert, nice, okay. So that's great, got a MJ, it's an, a crash insert, so that's cool, take that. Um, I was feeling kind of odd that I hadn't gotten a MJ. I mean, we got all those assignment cards, but I just, they weren't doing it for me. So that's cool, I mean, we did get the MJ versus Anthony Hardaway one, so that as well, but happy to get a full MJ there. So that's cool, and it's an insert um, in good shape. So we'll top load all these just after. I usually do that during the video, but uh, because it's a longer break and I'm kind of I'm kind of rolling slower, um, not trying to slow myself down anymore. So we'll be as soon as this uh, as soon as I hit cut, then we'll uh, we'll top load all these uh, all of these cards, of course. So always always do that. So I guess we can put MJ here so we can actually see him a little bit. Cool. So actually. That MJ hit kind of made me like put a little other pep in my step. Uh, so that's good. Uh, still have a few packs left. See what we can uh, pull out of here. Boom, another Kobe Bryant rookie card. So there's another Kobe rookie. I have this card. It's gold all at the bottom. But I'll totally take this. There's Kevin Garnett, Jermaine O'Neal, and Kobe Bryant. So this is still a legit Kobe Bryant rookie card. Uh, so that's great. So one full one, and we have, have hit the money. I mean, if I was being greedy, I'd say one full Kobe Bryant rookie along with, uh, that's a nice card, along with, um, well, I guess I can double you up for a second, uh, a base Jordan, and um, I'd, I'd be like, we've gotten everything we need out of this pack, uh, this box. So, pretty nice. We've got Allen Iverson, uh, Ray Allen, there's Shaq, so that's cool. Our first Shaq, so we got a Shaq out of here now. All right, man. I don't know, uh, what time is it? <laughs> start breaking at exactly this time next time um so there's jerry stackhouse again pj brown next to rod strickland and reggie miller so get a nice little collection of cards out of here like i said the, the price on this isn't like astronomical but you know if you go online put in 96 97 uh, basketball box you're gonna see that uh, they are all over the place um, all over the place and so mostly high and then every now and then you'll see one or two that's like oh I could afford that but the rest are just insane I mean they're not really insane they're just they're cards so I don't know how much you want to spend on a box of cards for a chance it's oyster tag there's mark price So there's, of course, Sharif Abdul Rahim. And Sam Cassell. All right, last three packs. And then we're going to be uh, gonna be good to go. Oh, that yellow got me. So there's... Uh... All right, there is Shaq. So I guess we, we'll take two Shaqs. Take two shacks. Some of the Jason Kidd. This pack's sticking together a little more than the others. So another kid card. Put that there. This is uh, Dana Barros. And there's Dominique. 
this one's hot. Feels weird. It's like uh, it's not like it's like just not sliding apart like the others. Is the Charles Speedwell? Okay, and Charles Outlaw. So that pack was. Uh, we got Jason Kidd out of it. We got another uh, Sharif Abdul Rahim. But now we have uh, two packs left, and then we're gonna be. All done with our 1996, 97, collector's choice break. Hmm. Scotty Pippen, we haven't gotten him yet. That's nice. There's another sort of Jordan. So put that there. I mean, it is a Jordan card. It counts as a Jordan card. Just, you know, those one-on-one -on -one cards... Uh, they always kind of throw me, so. And Antonio Davis. So we're down to our last pack. I've never pulled the card, the chase card, in the last pack of any break that I've done. So Kobe Bryant rookies in here. Base. Be feeling real, real good. But we did pretty we did pretty well actually. Um, you know, we could have done a lot worse. There's no question about that. Um there's Greg Miner. If you'll let go of uh, whoever you're hanging on to there, buddy. Got another one of these. This is uh Tony Kukoch and Def Shrimp. There's a really odd Steve Nash picture. Uh, so we got another Steve Nash out of here. So that's good. All right, we got a couple cards stuck together here. Come on, baby, big money. Rashid Wallace and Vaughn. So we did not pull the Kobe Bryant that I was looking for, but we did pull these two Kobe Bryant uh, cards right here. So the one-on-one cards. We pulled this uh, Council Legitimate Rookie, uh, Kobe Bryant Rookie card, so we did get this one. We got this uh, Michael Jordan insert card, so no base Jordan. We got two Ray Allen rookies, Allen Iverson rookie. We got these two Jordans right here, and then we got two Shaqs, a whole bunch of uh, Steve Nash and uh, sticker cards. So thanks for joining me. Um, we have another 1996 uh, box coming up soon, so we'll continue our quest for more uh, Kobe rookies. But I would say this is a success. We did get three. Uh, so we'll see you on the next break. Bye-bye.